Well, looking ahead, the Valdosta State football team plays for the Division II National Championship tomorrow night. I want to bring in ABC 27 sports anchor Dom Tibbetts now for some team coverage on this. Dom, this isn't the first time this has happened. No, Janning, far from it. It's a rematch of the 2018 game and the national title game. Same opponents at the same stadium. Sports director Allison Posey has been in Texas all day with this Blazers football team, providing exclusive coverage of everything VSU right here on ABC 27. She joins us now from McKinney, a suburb of Dallas. Allison, the loss of state. This experience is being enjoyed now by more than just the Blazers football team. To be a part of a national championship program is special. For the Blazing Brigade cheer and the Red Hots, they almost didn't get to make the trip to McKinney, Texas for this national championship game. But thanks to Blazer Nation, they are here and they are ready to represent. They're a big part of our success, so that's going to be a lot of fun and hopefully give us a little bit of a home atmosphere. <laughs> After we score, we, we always hear them, we always get fired up every time. They Music that was almost silent when it came time to make the trip to McKinney. Definitely when I saw the, um, the goal at 75,000, I went, oh Lord, that's going to take a bit to get. Get it? Got it. Thanks to strong supporters, enough money was raised to send the 100 plus member Blazing Brigade, Cheer, and the Red Hot Stains team. It just meant a lot that people actually wanted us to not only have just regular fans, but the Spirit program and the band to come out and help support the Blazers. When I saw the amount of support coming from Blazer Nation and the amount of outpouring of love, it warms our hearts. Hearts that are as invested in this program. We always think of like, okay, this is our time, but if we're there to support the Blazers, then we're there to support the Blazers. As the program is as invested in them. It's a big, big advantage that we're getting to travel pretty much everybody involved with our program. That Division II National Championship game between 